Today we do a review on these L'Oreal Paris Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipsticks that I picked up. And let's go ahead and talk about the packaging. Very simple, very clean, it's important. I like it a lot. And on the back right here, it actually has like a little bit of a tab or like a piece of paper. So you go ahead and pull this over. And it has, it just says made in USA of US and or imported ingredients. So if you're looking for the ingredients, you're probably going to actually have to go like online or like the website itself and search for it. So here I have two colors and the first one we have here, this is in 360 Angara and we have this one is in 362 Plum Bum, which is such a cute name. Alright, so I actually really like the packaging since how it kind of like curves in on both sides. So it's actually really easy to like get like a grip of it. Alright, so let's go ahead and talk about the Dofla applicator first. So this Dofla applicator seems really similar to those um, Smashbox liquid lipstick that I have tried and used. It's like a triangular shape and then it has like a hole in the middle. So this one is actually really easy to apply. So it's really great for like lining like the outer corners um, and then applying it on. Like, like when you apply it on like it's really nice very smooth and then it like dries really fast too and as for pigmentation it's actually um i would say the pigmentation is actually pretty good like one swipe you'll definitely go ahead and see like the color on your lips all right so as for long lasting wise i would have to say i am actually quite surprised how long this um liquid lipstick lasted for me since i was eating and drinking and wiping my mouth a little bit did come off if you do decide to go ahead and touch up i would highly suggest like removing the whole entire um lipstick before um applying on a new layer because sometimes when you touch up with your existing layer it kind of, it might get a little bit patchy or it might get like a little bit uneven especially like in color wise all right, so let's go ahead and try these on. First color I have here, this is 360 Angora. What do you guys think of this color? I definitely do not like this color at all. It kind of like washes me out uh, or it kind of makes me look like I'm not feeling well or like I'm a little bit sick. This is a 362 Plum Bum. What do you guys think of this color? Oh my goodness. This color, it is so dark. Like when I looked at the packaging, I didn't really think that it was going to be that dark. But after applying on my lips, I'm just like, whoa. This is like a dark plum color. I'm not really sure about like I kind of like it. I kind of don't like it. But I feel like with this color, I can probably like work my way around it. on these liquid lipsticks right here i would have to say of course they're very affordable i love how comfortable they feel on the lips and i love the pigmentation i love how long lasting it is it lasted me a good 10 hours but the one thing that kind of does bug me a little bit is that when you go ahead and remove this it does take some time and you probably might have to scrub down on your lips a little bit just like how i had to do so other than that, I would say I definitely really like these um, liquid lipsticks. I definitely will go ahead and try out more colors from the line. And also, one more thing is that um, for some reason, I feel like uh, when you look at like the color of the lipstick from its packaging, it doesn't look that dark. But when you go ahead and apply it on, it just it kind of looks like a little bit darker so i'm not sure maybe if it only applies to me or does it also apply to anyone else who have tried and used these well that is it for today's video and i shall catch you guys later bye